up fam it's your girl sleepy back with another video so have you guys ever wanted to quit well these people have thought about quitting quit on the spot or been in a situation where they had to quit but let's see how they handled it so it's my first day at work y'all i swear to god if they got me doing some wild shit i'm quitting first day i don't care word when it's set it's over hey yo i'm out you can tell them i'm, I'm done what I'm really so you quit your job on the first day because the people that you work for actually wanted you to work i mean really it was some boxes on the ground what they wanted you to put the boxes on the shelf or they wanted you to throw them away what do you guys think about that that is just absolutely crazy silly now this young lady i absolutely feel bad for because clearly she did not want to quit she was actually forced to make this decision because of entitlement people in their entitlement I completely understand you just have to put your mask on in order to walk inside. We're just literally uh, walking five feet into the restaurant. I don't understand. Just, just, it's, I, under, I understand. Um, I, uh, so if you I can't don't, don't mind, can you please just put it on? I mean, like, I just put the uh, lipstick on. Yeah, I could, I could go, go, get, over, I'll go get I my manager for you. Yeah, I don't see why I need to have a mask on to go five feet well, into man, a because restaurant. It's, it, we're, we're that living. girl's not wearing one. That girl's not wearing oh, one. I'll explain to you if, if, if you don't let me so talk. I'm it's not people, walking five feet into a but restaurant. It's people like I'm you. already in. Ooh. I'm already people in here. People like you that make it difficult to have a job. I'm going to get paid enough to be here. And it's not fair because it's not even my fault. I just quit. I'm sorry. Thank you. Thank you a lot. Oh, my God. Jeez. She should seriously just left. Fine. Fine. I'll wear it. I'll wear the mask. Fine. Happy? Are we happy now? All of a sudden, really? Just put the, just put your mask on. You know, I totally understand how she feels. You know, you got people all over the world quitting their jobs because you can't control another adult actions of what they do. Okay, yeah, you might work at Family Dollar, you might work at a clothing store or wherever where there's people coming in and out and you're forced to say, uh, excuse me, can you put your mask on? Because that's what they're telling you to do. But when you get a customer that's coming in, they're really like, what? You, you just work here. You can't tell me what to do. Like, what do you do? But I totally understand, you know, my dad got sick when COVID, when COVID first uh, came out. And I really understand, you know, I don't want nobody around me without a mask because even though I might not have it and I'm fully vaccinated, I don't want to go visit my mom and get my mom sick or my dad sick and they're older. I mean, come on. So, yeah, people like that pisses me off. Yeah, we do have um, a right to make our own decisions and choices but when it comes to my parents and my family I, I'm not willing to bet their lives so whether I believe in it or not I still am going to make that choice to do it for the simple fact that I don't want to get nobody in my family sick point blank like it or, hey like it or not that's what you got let me know what you guys think um, but you guys have done the same thing or would you, do, would you just have sucked it up and be like, okay, I'm not even going to bother with it. I'm going to just let the supervisor handle it and just let that be it. Or how would you guys have handled it? Yeah. For the hazard for today, we got these motherfucking nuts. Fuck you, fuck you, you're cool, fuck you, you're cool, there's my fucking bag. <laughs> Here's a good candy, go fuck yourself, I'm out. Classic. <laughs> <laughs> that's it. You out of here? Well, that's one way to do it. Yo, check it out. Family Dollar. Lincoln, Nebraska. They all quit. The other place was here in Lincoln, Nebraska at Burger King. Less than two miles away from here. Ain't nobody here. Well. That's another prime example of all the employees walking out. I'm pretty sure they didn't just want to all walk out when they have bills to pay. But I wonder what happened there. But it was like, you know what? I'm out of here. I wonder what happened. Deb, can I help you? Hi, this is Katie. I was just calling to let you know that I am not coming in tonight or ever. 
Um, I decided that I don't want to work for someone who is accusing me of lying about my grandpa's death. Um, I just want to let you know that you don't really know me or anything going on about my chaotic life and you threatened my job over the phone when he literally passed yesterday. Um, so I'd rather not pay my rent than work for someone like you. And uh, don't worry, I will send you a copy of his obituary in the mail as soon as we get it written. So I quit. Bye, Deborah. <laughs> That's right. Well, kudos for her for standing up for what she believed in. Let me know what clip you like. And in the comment section, let me know how you guys feel about it. If any of these kind of things ever happened to you. If you've ever been forced to quit or you've ever made that decision just fucking because you want this. Just because you, just because you could. All right. Hit me up, like, subscribe, hit that notification button. And thank you so much for rolling with your girl.